ஹாய் மை செல்ஃப் சுகன்யா அசிஸ்டன்ட் ப்ரொஃபஸர் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஆஃப் பிஸ்னஸ் அட்மினிஸ்ட்ரேஷன் இன் டாக்டர் ராஜலட்சுமி காலேஜ் ஆஃப் ஆர்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் சயின்ஸ் கோயம்புத்தூர் ஸோ டுடே ஐ எம் கோயிங் டு எக்ஸ்பிளைன் தி டாபிக் கேர்ள் கிளஸ்டர் ஸோ யூ எனி ஆஃப் தெம் நோ அபவுட் த கிளஸ்டர் ஓகே நவ் ஐ எம் டெல்லிங் அபவுட் தி கிளஸ்டர் விச் இஸ் ப்ரெசென்ட் இன் தி டேட்டா மைனிங் கான்செப்ட் விச் இஸ் என்டர்லி டிஃப்ரெண்ட் யூ ஆர் நாட் கன்சிடர் திஸ் வித் தி ஆர்டினரி கிள ஆர்டினரி கிளஸ்டர் so this is entirely it's a different uh, okay uh, i am going to tell about the clustering uh, definition so it is a group of object that belong to the same classes for example in the uh, in your class uh, totally 60 members are present so we are we are going to categorize into two concept we all know that one is a female category and another one is a male category so we are going to segregate into the two classes which is on the same type okay this is the example for normal clustering basic example and simple example for cluster so likewise similar objects are grouped into the one cluster and uh, this similar objects are class classified into the another another cluster so there are two or more cluster may be present uh, for the prescribed example so next it is the process of making of group of uh, abstract objects into the classes which are into the similar objects so what are the points to be remember while considering about the clustering yes the cluster of the data objects can be treated as a only one group the while doing the cluster analysis first we have to partitioning the data into the groups based on the similarity then assign to the particular topic which uh, assign to the particular group or cluster It, uh, for example uh, i am segregating into the two groups additionally i am adding one item into that particular main group means the particular item may be present in first group or second group based on some criteria i am going to segregate into the i am going to add it into that particular group maybe a group 1 or group 2 or cluster 1 or cluster 2 so the main advantage advantages of clustering over the classification is it is adaptable to the charge uh, adaptable to all the changes which are applicable and helps to uh, single out of the features that distinguish from the different types of groups may be present so where the clustering analysis may be uh, useful means it may be useful in market analysis marketing research that is the particular object may be present in this category only may, because in the market many items may be present one will be the vegetables one will be the fruit of fruits and another will be the grocery item and something something etc may be present so if we want to purchase one item in the vegetable means we are going to purchase in a vegetable mar- vegetable uh, holding area so that's it that is the one group in that may be many groups may many clusters may be present like that the way variations of vegetables items may be present that is the cluster so marketing pattern recognition data analysis and image processing also hmm, uh, these fields may be used in the clustering concept and it is also helps uh, to marketers discovering the knowledge about about their customer bases and also uh, can categorize their characterize their uh, customers group based on the purchasing patterns items so in biologically field we can uh, derive the plant and animal uh, animal taxonomies categories genes with similar functionalities and gain insight into the structures inherent to the population so and also uh, it helpful to identifying the areas which is uh, similar land use in the at uh, observation of uh, databases and uh, also identifying the cla- and also identifying and classifying the documents on the web for the information discovery you all know that you are in, in your phone for example in your phone also it going to follow some categorization and uh, segregation concept yes for example the photos and videos and screenshot all may be present in some other folders likewise the, these groups are in uh, groups are common in that particular item may be many folders may be present that is the clustering concept next is a cluster analysis serves as a main tool to gain insight into the distribution of the data to observe the characteristics of other users and what are the requirements uh, useful for uh, for clustering concept is 
scalability, ability and discovery of the clusters and high di dimensionality may be present and analyze and uh, ability to deal with the noisy data. Noisy data is nothing but it may be contain duplicate data or some of the values may, may not be present in particular field that is called as a noisy data. So these are the basic items have to be followed in the uh, for analyzing the clustering concept. Okay, any other doubts means you can send a uh, query in the comment box. Okay, thank you.